Hello everyone, welcome to my Nora Bay farm here in Stardew Valley. My name is Melanie Bay. Thanks for joining me today. It is the 27th of winter. Winter is almost over. It felt like it just started too. And it is it's Sophia's birthday today, so we definitely have to give her something. Oh, good morning, guys. What are you doing at my front door? Ah, uh, what a beautiful day, huh? It's wintry, but okay. You know, as a saloon owner, I hear about everything that's going on in town. I remember when you first moved here, everyone was a bit unsure what to expect. A stranger from the city, an unknown personality. <laughs> These stuff sisters. <laughs> it's pot. I always found this cutscene so strange. Sorry, I have to stir this pot every five minutes. Anyways, what was I saying? Oh yeah, you know, it's like when you're making a sauce. If you put it on your spice, you can ruin everything. Oh god, you gotta love it. You just gotta love it. But then again, there's always a chance you'll create something new and delicious. I would think that pot would be getting really cold just standing outside in the middle of winter, but... Uh, what I'm trying to say is, it's been great having you in town, and I've come to think of you as one of my good friends. I'm glad you feel that way, guys. Anyways, I came to give you something. I was cleaning out the back room and I found this old mini jukebox. I want you to have it. Nice. Not only is he carrying around an entire jukebox, I mean it's a mini jukebox, but still. He's carrying around a pot of food and a mini jukebox. I mean, that takes some skill, I would think. It's actually an old do-it-yourself project of mine from many years ago. They're pretty easy to make, so just in case you wanted to make more, I brought the blueprints for you. Learn how to craft the mini box. Thanks, Gus. Well, I'm gonna head home. I gotta get this marinara back on the stove. Have a good one. Okay, me and my mini box. Let me actually store that. This, I think, this is one of the my favorite gifts that you can get. I mean, I have lots of favorites. To be honest, but this is one of them too. Okay, let's check the mail. Mail. Ah, Clint sent us a recipe for bean hot pot. Thanks, Clint. Thank you. Thank you for your help with the fish. Nature is usually good at keeping things balanced. Oh, the farm computer recipe! Yes, I love, love, love the farm computer. And Willie sent me an escargot recipe. Oh my god, lots of people love me right now. You guys are loving me. Oh, makes me sad and happy at the same time. Okay, look at that. Look at that. We're doing pretty good with the friendships. Okay, oh, and look at all this forage ready today. It's just a fantastic day. Yeah, we should have some mint ready tomorrow, or possibly today, actually. Yeah, it should be today. So that's not too shabby. I'll grab all of this stuff that's ready right now. And I guess I will sell all these things today, including the crystal fruit. So right now I have quite a bit of money. I really want to go to Skull Cavern today, and I think I just might head out right at like 9.30. I'm going to... I want to give my chickens some love. I do. You know, my cows and my goats. But they'll be just fine if I miss them for one day. So if, depending on the time, I may just have to... Give them some hugs and kisses tomorrow instead. They'll be fine for one day. Um, I want to grab my coffee. 
And I also want to put some stuff in the keg, I believe it might be empty. Let's see. Let's go have a look at the keg. Oh no, let's go see the chickens. We'll see the chickens, then the keg. Priorities, man. Priorities. <laughs> now I feel bad if I miss the cows and the goats and the piggies. Hi guys. Hello my friends. Mwah, 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 mwah. Lots of kisses. Let's see what we're producing. We've got some eggs, making some mayo. We've got lots of mayo. Let's take some of those and get those sold. Okay, I'm going to see I'm gonna see the the barn animals instead. I really want to go get my coffee too, but I also want to really go to a skull cabin early. Hello? <gasps> Look at my pigs! They're all grown up! Hello, big piggies! Yay! So as soon as spring starts, these guys are going to be finding me horse and horse of truffles. Hooray! I am excited! Here we go. And... Oh, there's some okra that I'm already down here. Oh boy. There's so much to collect today. So much to do and not enough time. It's already 9 o'clock. Ah, am I gonna make it? Well, I'm gonna still make it spell cavern. I just won't get to go like right at 10 when Pam's at the bus stop. Which is fine. It's not the end of the world, I suppose. No, I don't want to eat the sweet corn. I want to get my golden scythe and get all this delicious coffee because coffee is very useful. I think I might take, I got two spicy eels when I went to Skull Cavern last time, so I think I might as well take those with me. Okay. Harvesting with the golden side is so awesome. Okay. Oh, strawberries are ready now. Oh my goodness. So much to do. So much to do. I can't wait for my ancient fruits to be ready. Okay, back to the farm. And we will get going to Skull Cavern. But I want to definitely want to try to get some bombs with me this time. And I want to get. I don't have a, I would like to have a stronger pickaxe, but you know, that's, that's not happening right now. I have three iridium bars, so I eventually will have five and then I can upgrade my pickaxe, but that's not happening today. I'm going to hang on to these strawberries just because I think I want to process them and get out another group of 24 strawberries. Let me just save those in here for now. I'll save all of these goodies in here. I didn't get to... Why do I have all these things with me? Oh my goodness. Um, let's put this in there. This in there. Put that away. Oh, and I didn't put the golden sight back. Ah! Oh, a ruby ring increases my attack by 10%. I'll keep that. Okay, let's see what ring I actually have on right now. I have a magnet ring and a glowstone ring. So I'm going to get rid of the one magnet ring because the glowstone ring does have a magnet on it. It's just, you know, even more powerful with two. But yeah, I think definitely increasing my attack right now, that is going to be very, very useful. So let me put this in there. Let's put this row to process. And uh no space. Space continues to be my biggest enemy. Okay, so I got my pickaxe and my sword. I got some energy. I got some speed boost. Let me put this away. I don't need it with me. Am I ready for this? 
Oh, can we get the spicy eels to chew? To go even faster. So I'll put this here. This there. This there. I need to put away my golden scythe. I just have way too many things. I'm going to sell this spinner. I don't ever use these. So I might as well get some money for it. Let's go, let's go, let's go! Skull Cavern, here we come! Hey, Pam. Take one to get to the desert, please. And depending on how things go, we just might just pass out in the cavern again. The absolute worst we'll lose is a thousand dollars if we just uh, pass out for the night. If we get knocked out, however, that's a whole other story. I would like to collect all this forage. I'm doing it. Just collect a few. God. It's hard to pass them up. Okay, stop it. Nope. Wrong direction. Wrong way. The cave is over here. Now I do have access to the elevator, but I'm not using it until I get to level 100. That way I feel like I earned it. Oh, it's open already. Oh, a shaft. Nice. I will take this. And, ooh, eight levels. I'm not going to complain about that. I'm going to actually um, get my coffee going and I'll get my spicy eel. So you can have two buffs if one is a drink and one is a food, which is what we have right now. So we're getting double the effect. Give me your slime. Give me some iridium, please. Ooh, thank you. That's all I have to do, say please. Oh, I've learned a lesson. Saying please works on slimes. Come on. Where's my ladder? Can I have a ladder, please? Oh, oh, oh. oh perfect timing. <laughs> Uh, if that only truly worked, like, consistently and in real life, that would be amazing. <laughs> Though, I try to say please as much as I can. Please and thank you. It's just polite, and it doesn't hurt anyone to be polite. Okay, come on, let's get a ladder, please. Oh, secret note. Oh, oh, I, I didn't see this guy coming, ah! Oh my goodness. Why is my sound not working? Let's see the secret known. It's Abigail, thing she loves. So now when we look at Abigail's, we'll see something. Oh no, I forgot to give Sophia a present. Oh, Sophia. Oh, tease. What do I do? I don't really have anything to give to her anyways, but still, I wanted to try. So we know all the things Abigail loves, which is good. Oh, I feel bad now. Oh, I'm sorry, Sophia. Like, if some miracle happens and I, like, get to, like, 100 super fast, <laughs> I'll go back to town after and... Give Sophia a present, but that's not happening. Oh, I can't believe I just did that. Wow, wow. I, uh, yeah, that really sucked. <laughs> My own fault. That's okay, we'll do it again. But I got that mine shaft though that dropped me eight levels. Ah, that's unfortunate. But I've learned something else today. Be careful when you're eating when you're next to the, the ladder. Because you can easily end up 
climbing up the series and starting all over. Come on, give me a new ladder, please. Or another shaft that gives me like 15 level drops, maybe. I'll accept that too. Okay. Still a good luck day. Oh, another shaft. And it's like, it's only 3.30, so let's go for it. Oh, eight levels. Yeah. Not going to complain. Oh, no, I don't want to eat that. I don't want to do it by the... <laughs> this staircase again okay just need a few more shafts and then we're golden now I think like after level 25 that's when you kind of start seeing more iridium note so let's aim to try to get there oh another free spicy eel love it Come on, Slam. You want some of this action? You got it. Oh boy. Oh, we got a mushroom in here as well. These slimes really hit hard though. Holy cow. Let's eat this last feel snack. And I am going to put this cactus fruit in its place. But I'll also eat this algae. Let me check out this secret note just so it can be out of my inventory. Ah, it's another one for Lyle. And we're going to explore all of those in sequence. So once we complete all of the ones from Lyle, I think I'll kind of read through them. At that point, uh, these slimes are not going easy on me. They're like they're here to play hard, and I'm not quite fully equipped for that. Oh, I forgot to bring my bombs. Oh boy. Well, that would have been a lot more useful, but what can I say? It's already been done. Let's grab this. Another ladder will be very good right now. I really despise these spiral levels. Oh, I've got another piece of iridium at least. Not bad. Okay, let's put this purple mushroom in the place here and we'll eat this white algae. Got three pieces of iridium, <laughs> which is kind of sad, but it's three more than I had before, so I'll take it. Oh, another one. And a ladder. Thank you, slimes. Ooh, look at this! What? On level 12? Holy, that is really lucky. Wow. Just like that, four nodes. Pretty sweet. I wonder if there's more up here. Let me have a quick look. No, it doesn't look like it, but that's okay. That was pretty amazing. Okay, let's grab this ladder down. Wrong button. Oh, another ladder. Let's see what's on this floor, though. I would hate to run away from a floor that I already had already in my mint. Doesn't look like much. Let's go down. Warp totem to the farm. Okay, so maybe I don't need to pass out in the mines after all.
Oh my goodness, look at that, more iridium. I have 80 now. That's incredible because I'm only on level 14. So yeah, definitely benefiting from the good luck day today. See if we can get a few more levels so I get some more. Another secret note that I'm going to read right now to save this spot. Uh, borrowed a necklace from mom. Okay, so we'll have to find that necklace. But not right now. Let's keep going. See what we can find in here. Get out of here, you. Okay, got a ladder, but let's see. Oop. I'm really missing not having sound on this because I can't hear when these things are approaching. Okay, let's eat another spicy eel. Let me check my sound settings here. Maybe I shut it off without thinking about it. It's pretty low, but that's how I usually have it. So, oh, nothing. I don't know what's going on with the sound. But it's not the end of the world. Take these guys out here. Would appreciate some more iridium, please. Let's see what's up here. Don't eat these. Okay, let's head on over here. Is there anything good in here? No? No iridium? Okay, so no iridium here. So let's just find our way down. Here we go. I don't really like doing these mummy levels just because I can't kill them. It sucks because you really need to have a bomb. Eventually there's going to be a augmentation you can do to your sword. Ooh, what are you doing? What are you doing? Where you can get like your sword enchanted and one of the enchantments you can get is a crusader enchantment which uh, actually kills the mummies without having to use the bombs which is like one of my favorite enchantments well i got some cold coal which is better than nothing i like coal i need coal i need lots and lots of coal oh look at all the gold over there i'm gonna grab that I mean, I could get gold in the regular mines, but look at that, a shaft, 1040. Let's see how far we can get down. Another eight levels, wow. That's three times they have gone eight levels. Anything good down here? No, let's head down. Oh, why am I like so low? I need to heal. Ah. Oh my gosh, another shaft exposed. Let's go for it. Jump in. Six levels this time. But this one has some, oh, fake iridium. <laughs> but these crabs usually drop iridium, so it's not so bad. Oh my goodness, look how low my life is. That was pretty close. Okay, let's see where we're getting. Come on, give us another ladder, please. Maybe there's some goodies up here. Oh, 
ladders though. We'll take it. Oh, it's getting late. Okay, well, I'll just take whatever I can get now. Go ahead and drop me a spicy L. Oh, well. Oh, ladder. Let's go for it. It's 12.30. See how far we can get. Grab this earth crystal. They get 20 pieces of iridium, so that's four bars. So I will have enough now to upgrade my pickaxe. Oh, there's more over here. Gotta get it, gotta get it, get it. Oh my gosh, did I die now? Ah, uh, he gave me nothing. What did I get from that dino? Anything good? No. Ladder. Okay, I think I'm gonna call it a night. Let's get to bed. Oh, Fishbone wants three Omni Geodes. Okay. I can do that for you guys in the morning. Well, it looks like I did get. Already have that though. So it's not that precious. But the 20 pieces. Oh my goodness, look at the time. What are you doing? <laughs> Go into the bed. <laughs> in my house at least, so. All good. That was quite a good run. 24,000. Awesome. So, once again, the crystal fruits coming in pretty clutch. Okay, it is now the final day of winter. I'm kind of happy, but sad too. <laughs> okay, this is now attempt number two of this recording for the 28th of winter, the final day of the season. Hopefully this time this quick save file actually takes. Um, we will go ahead and check the Queen of Sauce. Greeting is I, the Queen of Sauce, here to teach you a new math watering recipe. Your recipe is cranberry candy. Hooray! Let's grab a Jojo. And continue to stockpile in the fridge. So we got 20 pieces of iridium. So let's put those ones to process. I'll grab these guys out of here for now. I think I'm just going to make one more furnace. Take this guy right here. It was another really good luck day, but I don't think I'm gonna go to the mines today or to Skull Cavern. I think I need a lot of wood. And when I say a lot, I mean a lot. Let me just clear up my inventory a bit. We can get rid of this guy. Too bad. Oh, but that is into the forge chest. And hopefully can get around to doing some tidying up on the farm. Getting prepped for the first day of spring. You know, it's kind of bittersweet because I kind of like winter, but I'm kind of happy looking forward to spring too. So get these last bits of forage. And now I think I want to put some planting area in here as well. 
and I'm not sure exactly how I want to set that up. So let's go ahead and sell these guys. We'll sell this, and this, and this, and this, and this guy. And we'll keep our spicy eel for next time we decide to go crazy and go into the skull cavern. What's in this chest here? This is kind of my gifting chest. This is my community center chest. Well, community center is completed now. So let's call this chest. We will call it the Geodes. And museum chest. Anything that has to go to the museum, we will put in there. And let's let's make it purple. I love purple. And this is our gifting chest. So we'll make this purple as well. Because, like I said, I love purple. And we will call this. This is our Oprah Winfrey. The way chest, no, we'll just call it the gifting chest. Okay, I think these are just all gifts. I don't think my Sturdy Valley trophy is a gift, I'm not giving that to anyone, I'm keeping it. And this is more of a decoration. I don't know if anybody loves this as a gift, nor this bread, definitely not the bread. They should have seen no. I think somebody might like the red plate. I just don't know who it is. We'll take that out of there for now. We'll take you out of there. You don't belong. And yeah, let's leave it like that. That is our gifting chest. And up here, we just have some. So this is just uh, some produce we have fruits and veggies. So we might sort these out a little bit further, so it's not kind of just everything that we've ever harvested. Maybe I'll sort it into fruits and veggies, or maybe I'll even sort it into winter, spring, summer, fall crops instead. We'll leave that for now, though. We'll just put the food in the fridge. I'll keep the mushrooms out. Put that away. And I'll keep this one out as well. And do I have a gifting? Not a gifting, but a decoration chest. Look at how I forgot I got all these. Oh, I can't wait to start decorating. Okay, so we'll put this in here and this as well. And those are our decorating items. I want to color this chest though. It's going to be um, purple. <laughs> And we'll call it that cool. And that's it. Back out we go. What's in this guy? This is just really tools. But it has a whole bunch of other things. You know, I should get these things and take them to Gunther. I'm not going to use these anymore. Sell this, sell this, sell, 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 sell. Keep that and that. And, oh, I can move these Georgia Colas inside with the other Georgia Colas. I'll put this into the decoration. This can go with the decorations for now. The garden pot, um, just, I'm actually going to go set it down inside. Oh, I have this charcoal can here and I'm not even using it. I'll take that out of there. Um, we'll kind of leave that as such for now. No, we'll take the coffee out. Actually, we'll sell this obsidian blade as well. We'll sell that too. Um, we have two slingshots. I don't really need two, but I don't think the Adventure Guild buys slingshots. And I'll put this with my, my Clint and Museum stuff. You can go there. You can go there. And you, 
few, 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 few. I just need to remember to take these with me the next time I head out that way. And we'll put this guy right here. I'm probably not going to be making a whole bunch of stuff on a bunch of wood into coal just because wood is in such short supply right now for me. So let us, um, we can leave this in here because we'll use this for when we're going on a mining trip or something of that nature. We'll leave these in here as well. Leave this and we'll leave this as well. Back inside we go. Let's put the owl and we'll use them here for now. I'm in, going to place something into this pot soon enough. I'll leave that there. So the cool that can go in there. And we'll leave the one coffee in there for when we're ready to make some more. Is there anything in here that I don't need? These are basically just a few. Let's grab some of these melons out of here. We don't need all this excess melon. Might as well process it. Same with the blueberry. Now the cotton. I don't know why I have so much cotton in here. Why do I have so much cotton? I can process these, but I don't really want to make any kind of cotton wine. Um, that seems kind of odd to me. I'm just going to go ahead and sell it. Yeah, let's just sell that. And we can take the corn out, grab some of those. And we still have quite a few hops in here. I didn't realize that. Get those processed for sure. Okay, let's take these over to our kegs. Hmm, anything else in here? Oh, we'll just take all this coffee out of here for sure. And let's get rid of some of these bell peppers. I'm not going to process it, I'm just going to sell that. Oh, we got tons of cranberries too. Again, uh, I don't think I need to process these. Take this out of here, this, we can sell these right away. And this we can make into a new keg. Let's see what we need. So we need more wood. I don't have enough wood. So definitely going and getting some lumber chopped down today. Probably going to head it over to the Westwoods area. Get the wood. So we will, I think this is, this is cleared out pretty good for now. Can we fit any of this in here? No, but we'll take this guy out of there. Um, yeah, let's do that. And do we want to put anything into this chest? I'll put the oak bread in here. And I'll put this guy in here. I'm going to sell some of this stuff right now. Uh, cotton, bye bye. Sell, 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 sell. Um, I think I'm going to sell the cranberries. These ones I'm going to process. They're worth it. Selling the blueberries. Corn sold. We'll keep the hops because actually the pale ale is quite, it sells for quite a lot. We'll definitely keep the coffee, so well, let's go over to the shed, and we'll go have to say hello to our lovely animals. Take those. Oh, I think these guys need some fields. Okay, we'll get that for you in a few minutes. Okay. We'll get all 
all these in there. Here you and you. And that's that. I'm going to check out the mushroom cave, see what kind of stuff we got going in there right now. So we can definitely make some more elixirs with these. Because they're not a redeem quality. Oh, my baby lizard has hatched. I forgot all about this guy. And his name is Fry. Like Friday, short version of Friday. <laughs> Hello, my baby. There you are. Okay. So it looks like we are out of hay in this silo. So we'll definitely need to go swipe some more. Get rid of some of this grass. Oh, I'll need to get my scythe out. See, I put my scythe away so I could remember it when I go in here. And now I need it outside. How fitting. Did I put it? Did I leave it in here? I thought I did. Apparently, um, I didn't. Okay. So it must be in my tools chest. Okay, back we go. To the tools section. I certainly hope I left it in there. Let's make sure. Here it is. And I'm just going to label this. I don't really want to label it yet. It's kind of still kind of all over the place. Okay, let's cut some of this grass. And I think I might look at building another silo. I don't know if that is necessary. I can actually take all the hay out of the silo and store it in a chest and refill the silo as needed. I mean, I think that might be a better option than Taking up some extra room on the farm unnecessarily. Let's get in here. Okay, there we go. We got 240 now. And yep, the chest is completely empty. Grab all of that out of there. Oh, I shouldn't have filled it up because I wanted to collect some more. Oh well. I can wait till it runs low again. Okay. So grab these milks out of there. Get some processing. We go. I don't even have enough wood <laughs> to make another chest. Oh, it's sad days. I don't want to cut too much in this area just because my animals are going to be out tomorrow. Because it's going to be the first day of spring. Which means I should actually fix up the, the gate. But once again, that whole wood shortage thing is playing, taking effect. Okay, let's put those away. I guess I will put these back in here now. So those can be processed. I won't sort it. Um, I guess I'll store that there for now. And let's see how many of these we can make. So we can make four. And then we'll just sell the excess. So make four elixirs. 
then I'll keep my mushrooms, the common mushrooms. But I'll sell the rest of items. I don't really need those. So, sell, sell, sell this. And you know what? I want to keep the crocus. I'm going to put that into my gifting chest. Because Sandy loves crocuses and an iridium quality one that's extra special. Okay, I'll we'll put this here. I'm going to take this with me. Put this away, put this away. We'll take the hoe and the, our axe. We're chopping the wood. I really need to get this hoe upgraded, but I can't do it today. If I put it into Clint today, then I won't have it back until Tuesday. That will be after I need it, which is going to be tomorrow. So, we'll have to save that. And... I'm going to put this in here for now. I might take... I'll take some mushrooms for energy. And... Off we go. Grab this guy right here right now. Let's chop a mega amount of wood down. Okay, well, I think I've done a fair job of deforesting this area, unfortunately. But we got tons of wood. Nine, 1081. Wow, good job. Okay, let's see. Got a secret note here as well. Someone is waiting for you on level 100 in Skull Cavern. Gotta make sure and do that. Just not right now. One thing I noticed though, I forgot to bring the site. So all this beautiful grass, I could have been like scything. I didn't get to you because I decided to put it away instead. Poor planning on my part. So let's uh, let's go back to the farm and see if we can get back out here and get a little bit of this grass before tomorrow, just so we have at least enough to fill the barn and the chicken coop in the morning. We need at least 24. That should be fairly easy to get though. And also, I am going to put up my wood fencing. Now, I don't think these are actually lined up. I think this is the one that should be right. You know what? Focus. I'm going to go get the grass. Get the grass. Get the grass. Focus on the grass for now. I'll put all that good stuff away. Ah, it's already midnight. No. Okay, we'll just cut the grass on the farm. Cut this stuff right here. Okay, well, now they have at least enough for tomorrow. So let me finish with my. Refencing. Okay, we'll do as much as we can. For tonight, anyways. Time is it? One o'clock? Come on, go, go, go. Oh, I think that is why I set it up like that. So I should have 
breathe on the upper area. Oh well, <laughs> I'm sorry. We will. We learn. We'll put that there. And one more right here. And we'll you we need more wood. But we need to get to bed really fast. Are we gonna make it into the house? Go, 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 go. Okay. Probably not gonna make it to bed, but that's okay. We got in the house and that's what really matters. Okay, let's see what kind of money we made today. Oh, pretty good, 24,000. Can't complain about that. Well, I think that is it for this episode. Thank you very much for watching.